Hi guys. So it's the first of June. Lots of wire side fisheries. This little fella jumping in. He's not coming with me today, he's coming next time. Um yeah, so we're off for wire side fisheries, Foxes Lake, 48 hours, never fished there before. Um I've not really been told any information about it neither, so it's just trial and error when we go. Uh, just to be honest, I'm just going just to get the 48 hours, a little bit of a break and chill time. Um, so what I'll do, I'm going to set off, I had loads of problems with my car, I'm just picking my car off from the garage because it broke down and that. So, setting off a bit late. Um, what I'll do, I'll get there, I'll set up, get my rods out and bivvy up and everything. And I'll give us a little shout on where we're up to and where we're fishing and stuff. See you soon guys. Right, finally, it's, what time is it? uh, it's just gone three o'clock now, um, I've only just managed to get my rods set up and things like that, uh, I had a good look around the lake, I've picked peg six, uh, it's an end peg, I've got some nice overhanging trees to the right, uh, I can fish to the opposite bank so far down. Which, again, when I was having a walk around, I seen a couple of fish showing just off the bank. So it's somewhere I'll be having a look to get. And found a gravel bar in the middle. Um, yeah, so what I'm going to do, three rods, put my rods out. I'll um, attach some pictures in a minute. Just show you each of my rigs, what I'm fishing on. I'm just fishing them with a small bag. Not, not a big, just pellets. Nice small bag. Um I'm on a yellow wafter on one, pink wafter on the other, and a ten mil manila boily on the other one. So I'll um, attach some pictures, show show you what I'm fishing on and if I can I'll try and get some pictures of the lake and put a dot on whereabouts I'm fishing as well and hopefully I'll be back to you soon with a little bit of update. Hopefully with a fish, but I need something to be going right at the moment. I say everything's just gone wrong. Um all week it's just been one of them weeks and I'm sitting here now thinking probably not not gonna catch considering how my luck's going this week but fingers crossed guys I'll uh, be back to you with a fish soon. Cheers. Still a pike and a 10 mil manila boily. Bit of a mad taste to be honest. Um seen the end of my rod switching, but my alarm wasn't going, my spool wasn't going. I get up, I'm watching it for a couple of minutes, watched it twitch a couple of times. So as it twitched, I picks it up, boom, hooked into a pike, um, cleaning the mouth. Done well, to be honest, I thought it was going to come off. Um, not a massive, I don't know, £8, pound, I, I don't know, I wouldn't like to put a weight on, I'm not too sure when it comes to pike, but we're off to a start guys, rods are back out and um, yeah, hopefully back soon with another fish, cheers.
evening guys so still not a more just a one pike i've um it's half eight now first night i'm just getting ready to reset my rods for the night um three different rigs i'll again same as before post some pictures of the rigs that i'm using um and we'll see how it goes i'm i'm looking and I'm seeing seven or eight fish boshing um, out in open water, so the plan of attack is going to be I'm going to put one in open water and two um, just off the edges, little little spots that I like the looks of, and I've seen fish there today, so I'll uh, get them pictures over to you and hopefully be bruises in the night and have a fish. See you soon, guys. morning guys um so it's just gone four o'clock in the morning um decent run put up a decent fight to be fair had a uh, new pb mirror 24 pound two absolutely buzzing um again it's a it, it's another trip another pb I just seem I, I don't know lately I don't know if it's luck or my angling's improving but I'm seeming to be getting getting them PBs in now. Um honestly I, I absolutely over the moon. I just when I woke the fella up I didn't realise it was four o'clock in the morning. When I woke the fella up next to me just to give me a hand with some pictures. Um that kid's miles away, so yeah. Buzzing guys. Gonna um, just put me rod back up now. Reset. So, so I got that. By the way, I got that on um, ten mil Manila boilie, socked with a couple of uh, maggots. So you'll see back out same spot. One of the margin spots. I, I first looked at when I got here. It's like a little water pipe. Well, it's like an overflow maybe. Um, just before that, there's like a like a branch coming out the water. Well, a couple of foot off the branch. Uh, I've had the pike and and the carpo from that spot now, so hopefully some more today and uh, as the day goes on and I'll keep you updated, guys. I'll uh, post some pictures. Oh, the same rod now, getting bleeps. I'm on back legs as well, so fingers crossed. I'm on them. See you soon, guys. <laughs> Afternoon guys, but it's quarter past three now, um, just done 24 hours to go, absolutely scorching it is, maybe there, bad in the sun as well, killing me, um, so what I'm going to do in a minute, I'm going to show you where I had the um, two fish, I'll show you what I was doing, where I was fishing to and how I was baiting it up and stuff, um, I'll walk you around with me when I'm going to do it, uh, when I'm next going to bait up, I'll walk you around with me, I'll show you how I was doing it, what I was baiting up with, Um, to produce two so, so far, so hopefully some more, e either today or through the night maybe, Um, yeah so what I'll do guys, I'll get back to you soon and I'll give you a walk around and show you where I was baiting up. Right so, show you this mix here. A mixture of pellets, uh, small pellets, variety of colours, and um, just put a little bit of attraction. 
Uh, they absolutely stink. So they've just all gone into little PVA mesh bags. Uh, so on this one, I've got a 20 mil monster crab boilie that is. Top with two pieces of corn. And then on my next one, as you can see here, uh, I've got double 10 mil vanilla boilies. Same in the mesh bag again. And then the third one is what got me my calf this morning. We've got 10 mil vanilla boilie. So with three maggots. <laughs> So yeah, um, when I cast out, I've been putting tiny little pop-ups just into a bag on its own onto the hook. Just so when I um, put my bait in, I can um, when the pop-up shows up, I don't know where roughly I'm. I'm gonna have to throw. Then you see, just something tying out, and it seems to have worked up to now. Like so, keep to it for the final night. First be pegged there guys. Um fishing one into that corner. I want to over I'll show you now. There you've got that swig. So I'm about just off it. Um walk around now and I'll show you how I'm beating up. So, round to the other side. It's the twig in the water I was on about. Now, I just. Wash me up. Fishing about there. Morning guys. We have nine o'clock now, final morning. Um had one more through the night, only small, with a 14-4. So ended up with three fish, pike two carp, PB pike, PB carp, so gone away buzzing again. Um that time where I've got to start packing down now, I hate this part. So I'm gonna get all my gear away and probably just sit on my rods for the last hour. If, um, if there's no more action guys, this will be the end and thanks for watching. Don't forget, same as always, like and subscribe. 
Um, next time I'm out on the bank, I'll give us another upload and see how we get on. Cheers for watching, guys. Take it easy.